How's it going, boys and girls? I hope you're all having a wonderful day, because if you're about to do what I'm about to do, that is going to change. Um, now, there's, you know, the training masters in Yakuza 5, just as with most other uh, Yakuza games, which, you know, they teach you new moves. Uh, most of the time, they're pretty handy moves that you want to have, but Yakuza 5 goes the extra mile of really really making you want to smash that fucking controller that you hold in your hand and buy another 10 maybe but you know as a pro gamer i absolutely cannot do this because this shit costs money okay so we're talking about akiyama's training in particular right now if you played yakuza 4 and if you've played um you know um, akiyama's training you would know that saigo saigo's training in 4 it is a bit of a pain. It is annoying, especially the last one. I think it's called Suicidal something. I forget. But the one where you fight him and his students and all of them have guns. He has a machine gun and they have pistols. Um, you might have played that and you might have found that kind of annoying. Now, well, ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you that with Yakuza 5, you should expect for this to be taken not one step ahead, 50 steps ahead, okay? Um... <laughs> Let's, okay, so I finished the training, uh, I got all of the moves, but let me show you a glimpse of the hell that you are going to get into with uh, Akiyama's training. Oh, and uh, one more thing, always, always, at all times, whenever you're about to train with Saigo, have an inventory full of healing items, because trust me, you will need them. And even then, maybe you'll be unlucky and... It still won't be enough, but hopefully, let's hope that it will be, okay? So, let's take a look over here. We're gonna train. Now, the the first three trainings might be, um, what did they say, endurable, I guess? You, you can kind of go through them. And you will have to go through the, 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 you know, true suicidal ones, but oh boy, you're not gonna have fun with those. So, um, let's take a look at su true suicidal running, right? Now, if I remember this right, if I'm not mistaken, you have to chase Saigo while his students keep throwing bombs to, like, always. They just fucking, all they do is stand. Okay, so watch this. Okay, so even Saigo, I, even Saigo himself throws bombs at you, and I do not understand the function of dodging in this thing, because... <laughs> well, oh my god, okay. I don't even need to explain why dodging is useless in this. But yeah, you, you've seen for yourselves. What the fuck is this? Oh boy, we have another one over here. Fuck you. Is he gonna... Okay, we're good for now. And look at how much fucking health he has. So like... Okay, maybe it was a mistake for me not to grab a bottle. I think there was one in the way. Because I don't think you're gonna last with uh, with uh, more than one left. I don't know. Oh yeah, I also didn't take a double health bar. If you can do that, do it. You're gonna need it for this um, training in particular. Because you cannot heal in this training. Um, the, the, suicide, the true suicide running. You cannot... Oh my god. You cannot heal in this. So if you can get a double health bar... Do that ASAP, look at this. So you do a lot of damage with this uh, bottle. Grab that as soon as you can. You need that. Now that we don't have the bottle, we're back to shit damage, but... Uh, what was I gonna say? Right, if you can get double health, do it. You will need that shit, trust me. Because dodging bombs is... I just feel like it's pure RNG. You're gonna have to get pretty damn lucky to actually dodge a bomb. Which I'm kinda surprised- oh no wait, there's someone up ahead, I'm, I, I don't feel safe. Okay. Somehow, miraculously, I managed to do it in one go, but I hope it goes just as smoothly for you. It does help, I, I wanted to say, it does help that my Akiyama is kinda leveled and I have some health upgrades, but if you have a short health bar, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. So, let's heal up again and take a look at the second suicidal training. Let's see what that entails. Right, train. The shooting one. This one is doable compared to the first one and the third one. But it's still annoying. 
So you just have to um, shoot them. So, wait, no, no, wait. I must be. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh god. No, 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 no. This is. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Change of plans. I don't know what was the plan, but. Oh fuck. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. My heat. My. Okay, so I'm not gonna go back into the fight yet, but the trick here, or at least what I would do, is get Saigo uh, mid-air so that he loses his wig. He's gonna waste a lot of time that way, looking for the wig. In that time frame, try to like beat the ever-living shit out of, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, his goons. So let us... <laughs> oh my god, okay, okay, wow, I, I I, went back for like two seconds and that happened. Okay, fine, fine. Saigo, Saigo, Saigo. Now, as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, if you take notice, if you look really closely, you can see that I'm being fucking the ass. Like, a lot. I just want... Okay, thank god. I thought that was gonna end, like, really bad. No, 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 no. no. Let's heal. Okay, thank god. Psycho! Help a man out here, I just want my moves, okay? <laughs> What's wrong with you, he says. That was one big epic fail, he says. You know what, Psycho? Fuck you.